podcasts on unctv.org are made possible through the financial contributions of viewers like you, who invite you to join them in supporting UNCTV. Main Street in historic downtown Hendersonville is home to a quirky and delightful little restaurant where everything is made from scratch. In tonight's House Special, Bob Garner takes us for a visit to Mrs. G and Me. For the strollers along Main Street in historic downtown Hendersonville, this small bistro beckons very invitingly. The wall murals will put you into practically any setting you desire, and Mrs. G and her kitchen staff will make that setting into a memory. You know, this is one of the warmest, most inviting bar areas I've been around in a while. They can be a little off-putting, but just putting these woven mats down just kind of draws you in to want to eat here. And Mrs. G also brought me some wild mushroom soup. Mm. She said, I know you just love food. I want you to try that. I love the roasted beet salad with fried goat cheese, toasted walnuts, and a tangy homemade dressing. The breaded goat cheese spheres were warm, soft, and fabulous. And while I'm on a roll with the goat cheese, you can bet I'm not going to miss out on this beautiful goat cheese tart. Look at this, goat cheese on the top and the bottom spread with pesto in the middle with some great tomatoes making it lovely on top. And a great way to have this is spread on top of some toast rounds. Now that served cool, whereas the other goat cheese I had was served warm. Totally different texture. The pesto really works well with the chilled goat cheese. Boy, that is terrific. The pliable garlicky baguette rounds were also perfect for the especially herbaceous and well-balanced olive oil and balsamic vinegar mixture. Oh, this is gorgeous. This is a tilapia in a lobster sherry cream sauce topped with shrimp served with angel hair pasta. This isn't the way I cook with it at home, but oh, what a treat this will be. Just as I suspected, that is so rich and so velvety on my palate. Mmm. Boy, those shrimp on top aren't bad either. Mmm. And of course, they have a really nice selection of wines and beers. For me, a nice, crisp, tart glass of Chardonnay. This is their special meatloaf with their homemade, thick, velvety steak sauce. They slice this meatloaf and then let it crisp up each slice in the oven before they bring it to the table. Mm. Mm. I'll tell you what, that has plenty of texture to it, which means it does have some fillers in it, but that's what, what is giving the meat, which is ground pork and ground beef, its particular bite. The flavors of that blend so well together, and that steak sauce is fabulous. This is a gorgeous potato medley, Peruvian purple, Yukon gold, rose potatoes, and nice orange sweet potatoes. And I'm going to try a little of that steak sauce with them. Mm. Mm. Mrs. G's bread pudding had a nice layered texture to it and was served with an appealing caramel sauce. For lunch or dinner, Mrs. G and me will be a great choice. For North Carolina Weekend, I'm Bob Garner. Mrs. G and me is at 502 North Main Street in Hendersonville, and they're open for lunch and dinner Monday through Saturday and for lunch on Sunday until 3 p.m. For more information, give them a call at 828-697-5350. To read Bob Garner's food blog and to find out how you can travel with him on a restaurant road trip, visit our website, unctv.org slash ncweekend for a link.
Podcasts on unctv.org are made possible through the financial contributions of viewers like you, who invite you to join them in supporting UNCTV.